romance. Here's O. Henry's famous Robin Hood of the Old West, the Cisco Kid. I don't know, Pancho, but it's around five miles over this ridge, and our horses are too tired to climb it. Yeah, and my boots is all over out, and I, and I can't walk around there my bare foot, this Cisco. So we'll go and find out who he is, eh? Yeah, maybe we can speak him up to let us go through, huh, Cisco? <laughs> <laughs> Southwestern mine number eight. No trespassing. What do you mean, Cisco? But, Pancho, that means that we're not supposed to go through here. I never seen so many signs. Look, there's another one over there. Warning. Stay away, Jack Kelt. You know, that's the most unfriendly hombre I never hear about, Cisco. Cisco, now I am sure of it. Say, hey, what's the meaning of this? Yeah, why are you throw the Johnny Hawk at Pancho? Now, I hope you two ain't gonna give me a lot of talk about this. A turn and ride back the way you came. You've got quite an argument there, mister. Reminds me of that time on Sonora, Pancho, you remember? Sonora? Yes, Sonora, Pancho. It was just like this. You two are talky ones, ain't you? Now, let's get. Oh, oh, oh yes, this Sonora, you know, I'm sorry, I forget to remember. Now I remember now, it's Sonora. <laughs> Adios, my friend. <laughs> trick. I'm sure the best shooting I've seen for a while. Hey, Cisco, I guess this Kelsey won't mind if we use this pass now, huh? Hey, keep your hands up. Why? Because I'm telling you to keep them up. I reckon not. If you was gonna plug me, you wouldn't waste all that fancy shooting. And hold my arms up as mighty tired. You have a lot of courage, my friend. What is your name? Kells? Nope. My handle's Greg, but I work for Kells, and he's going to be mighty unhappy about this. He's killed me up here for less than this. Cisco, I guess this Kells has got a pretty bad temper, eh? Who are you two? I am the Cisco Kid. This is my amigo, Pancho. The Cisco Kid? If I'd have known that, I'd have watched a little bit closer. This is a public road. Why is Kells trying to keep everybody off of it? Ask him. <laughs> So that kills, eh? Hey, Pancho, do you want to ride around or go through? We must stay through, this <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Someday you're gonna laugh yourself to death, Greg. Who are those maniacs? The Cisco Kid and his sidekick, Poncho. Uh, so the town of Lattimore is hiring its own gunfighters, huh? That's a good guess, Kells. 
I got a little hunch for you. They're working for the town folks. We got troubles. Francisco, yeah, don't you think of some place in this town where I can get my boots fixed, eh? Fixed? Yeah. Hey, Pancho, when are you going to get yourself a pair of new boots? No boots? What are you talking about, no boots? I just break myself into this. <laughs> They're only about five or six years old. <laughs> There is a shoemaker shop over there. I'm sure you can get a pair of new boots there. <laughs> new boots? I like this one. <laughs> Stop annoying me, Lucifer. Let me do my work. There you are, Pancho. There is your shoemaker. Hello, what is your picture? <laughs> you got a nice place here, right? It's a beautiful day outside, don't you? Customers. See, I want to... Uh, see, I... Well, I... in that case, gentlemen, welcome to my shop. You boots? No, I don't know when I want to get this sole and heel. <laughs> Man, it's an emergency. Oh, no, don't insult my boots. Uh, I want you to fix them. Never, you must have new boots. No, fix them. Robert, give me back my money, huh? Don't mind loss of he's, he's just having his little joke. A little joke, huh? Uh, this little blackbird, he's a thief. And... Blackbird? Lucifer is a crow. He's a blackbird. A crow. No, no, senor. This is the most stubborn man I've ever seen my whole lifetime. Now, listen, senor. He's a little bird, huh? Aye. Oh, he's a little bird. And he's a black. Aye. Huh? Aye. Well, <laughs> then he's a blackbird. No. Huh? He's a blackbird. Crow. <laughs> I think I'll let you two fight it out. Pancho, meet me at the hotel. As soon as this stupid mule fix my boots. Ah, you're a hard man to convince. What size will you have? I say no new boots. New boots, I don't know if it's those. You will. I won't speak. <laughs> don't you say like a log in a bump. Do what I told you. Bring me no boots. Peacemaker? <laughs> no, thank you, sonny. But I know just this fellow. You do? Gee, that's swell. All he's got to do is steal a fight and wear this badge. Say, you know where the shoemaker shop is? In there, there is a fellow by the name of Pancho. Now, if you can keep him out of fight, you'll earn the name of Peacemaker. Don't worry, we can handle him. Oh, there's Sid. Hi. Bye, son. <laughs> I hope Tommy wasn't bothering you. Not at all, Miss, uh... Well, Nina Lawrence. I run the Loring Freight Company. And uh, this is Albert Crook Jones, my driver. Hi. How do you do? I'm the Cisco Kid. Cisco Kid? I've heard of you. You're not working for Kells, I hope. Oh, that you can be assured. You seem to dislike Mr. Kells. I hate him. All the town's folks hate him. He's killed innocent men, and now he's going to kill the town. Would you mind telling me what's behind all this? Stealing. From the syndicate's gold of mine. Well, it's Placer Dickens and all the men work there. Two months ago, the syndicate started claiming our men were stealing gold. Were they? Well, they couldn't. The mines fenced in and the men changed clothes, entering and leaving, while a guard watches. So the syndicate brought Mr. Kells and other gunmen to stop the stealing, eh? Worse. They closed the mine yesterday and threatened to bring in outside labor. Well, that would ruin the town. And the town people will fight before they let this happen, eh? Somebody's been turning over rocks again. Look what's crawled out. You, Cisco, I want you. Sorry, Kells, but... Oh, 
are there. Mount your horse. You get your horse and meet us out of town. All right. Double crossing heel. He's joining Kill. No. They're forcing him to go with him. Let's get our horses. <laughs> you bet you lie. When you pick Pancho as the chief peace taker, you pick the best man what never was for that. <laughs> Peacemaker. And remember, no fighting. I remember, and Pancho is the best peace taker that never was. Huh? Where's this? Go on and show him. You mean your father? He was the fifth last time I saw him. Yes. Hey, Seth! Hey, wait, where's this go? He was kidnapped by Cal. We're going after them. Chico, kidnapped? Hey, wait for me. Hey, he's gonna get in a fight. I'm gonna ride along and stop it. Hold on a minute. You and Yankee wait here in case we're being followed. We'll go on to the mine. Right. Hey, Kels, why don't you try to find out how the gold is being stolen instead of starting a war over it? You don't have any proof that the workmen are responsible for it? My men don't take it. The nuggets certainly don't fly out of a mine. Let's go. Let's go. Somebody's coming, Yancy. Yeah, someone else is coming, too. Let's get out of here. We better go the back way and warn Cal. telling me the reason for all this, Kells? I figure you work for the town, and I just wanted to find out what they're planning. I don't know. I work for nobody. Right! You ran me down in the past today. Don't give me more excuse to kill you. Come here. I want 
to show you something. This is where the gold is weighed and sacked. Chances are you could pick up one of those sacks and leave. If you told me how the gold is stolen and by whom. What do you want? You let Cisco out of that mine, I'm gonna break it in 10,000 pieces. Hey, you got one minute. Now let him out, Tonto. Remember, Chief, no fighting. Yeah, but Cisco's my amigo. I gotta help him, don't I? Yeah, I guess you do. Wait, the rules of the club say you can fight in self-defense. What's that? You can hit anybody that hits you first. But you got to let the other man start the fight. Oh, yeah, but that ain't 50 60. Cal, we're in trouble with a bunch of riders on the way. Get him! Get him! Drop your gun! Get him! Get him! Stand there! Don't you move! Let's get out the back. Drop that gun, Cisco. Drop it, I said. himself, eh? Oh, so you like my little shell, the pretty ones, eh, Blackie? <laughs> That's no good. Take a good one here. Look, here's a, a real, real shell. Now, open your mouth, shell, eh? Huh? That's pretty good, eh? <laughs> Why, you, you load my gun, eh? Thank you very much, little blackbird. That's a nice little blackbird. But uh, I got uh, special business to do right now, so fly away. I like a good blackbird. Fly away. <laughs> Cisco. If I counted right, that's all your shells. Here's your chance, Cisco. If you still got a cartridge. Well, I was right. <laughs> <laughs> No gun? No gun. I'll just use my favorite weapon here, little Annie. If you're gonna take a sitting there, you're gonna run. Come and get me!
You were right. I should have used the gun. Too bad, Cisco. You put up a good fight. Uh, Senor Gales, uh, you take the first shot. Ready, Cisco? Pancho, you saved my life. Are you hurt, Pancho? What did he hit you? Yeah. Right in the middle of the bat, Cisco. You know, Cisco, I want to give up this thing being polite and let the other fellow have the first shot like the little boy told me to because someday someone's going to kill me till I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Where? We're going to take the wounded to jail. Then I want to take a look around. Just getting rid of Kelvin and his men, that's not good. Pancho, we've got to find out who's stealing from the mine. Yeah, but this company can always hire more skunks like these girls. But well, Cisco, I still don't see how people can steal from this mine. Come on. Gun away, Pancho. I know when I'm licked on the square. Yeah. Oh, here you are again. Eh? What'd you bring, Pancho? Huh? <laughs> Look, Cisco. The gold nugget. The crow. The robber crow. So he's been doing it, eh? So he's a thief. Cisco, I think we'd better take a look in on that shoemaker. Yes, I think that gentleman has a lot to tell us. Dear me, train and Lucifer to steal gold from the mine. Man, where's your proof? There's no gold in the shop. Sit still, Scotty. I'll find it. Boots. Ready for your trip to Phoenix, I am, sir. Yeah. These yours? Yeah. These workers, these way of done, Cisco. <laughs> If Albuquerque took this gold out for Scotty each week, there should be a thousand or more in these boots. Let's take a look and see. I don't carry gold out for nobody, and I got a schedule to keep. I'm leaving here, ain't nobody gonna stop me. Stick around, Albuquerque. There's gold in those boots. You and I are gonna bandy a few words. Look! The jackpot! Hey, I knew that Scotty was a crook. Hey! Wait! Hey, hey, hey! I'm a pretty good boot thrower, no? Yes, you are, Sancho. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hello, Tommy. You, you didn't see something, did you? Huh? Stop worrying, Pancho. Now that we caught the crooks, let's take them to jail. Uh -huh. Come on, get going. Let's win. For the whole town, I, I want to thank you for all you did. Uh, forget it, Nina. Chico, here come the kidlets. Maybe they're going to take my badge away from me, huh? <laughs> hey, see, Pancho! See, Willikers, kiddies, you ain't going to take the badge away from Pancho. I'm the most peaceful man that you didn't ever know. You are a very unpeaceful man, Pancho. The peacemakers salute you. Yeah, I salute you too. Look, Cisco, look. <laughs> oh, the coyotes, we, we are here. <laughs> oh, Pancho. Oh, Cisco, Robbie. Goodbye, amigos. See you soon. <laughs>